My name is Sina. I'm a PhD student at Toronto Metropolitan University, formerly Ryerson University. My name is Nastaran Zamanian, an Iranian graduate student at Northeastern University in Vancouver. My name is Mohammad Amin Hemati, Mina Tehwan's husband. Here, I studied and I graduated at Montreal College. I am Sahar Moradi, an Iranian student at Concordia University. My name is Peshkat and I'm an MBA student at University of Canada West. I am Azin, an international student in Canada. And this is what we call it, Hafsin. This is the apartment where I lived in Canada. And if Esmail was here for the Persian New Year's, definitely he would help me to prepare the best thing for the Noros, as what the others do for the Christmas. Noros. The Persian New Year is just around the corner and I'm gonna be really lonely this year. Just because of long and frustrating processing time of a supposed open board permit for Iranian. I've been living here alone without having my husband, my soulmate here by my side for more than six months because of long processing time for open board permit visa. It's been about eight months since I left my wife to continue my education in Canada. Now, it has been more than one year I applied for my wife's work permit visa. We are waiting for my husband visa for more than six months. The point for the couples like us that one of them had been rejected once, whether by Chinook system or by person, is that waiting time is going to be doubled just like we are getting old double time we trust what mr justin trudeau and mr sean fraser told about supporting iranian and we hope ircc will help us to join our spouse as soon as possible in canada during our wedding my partner and I made a promise to support each other throughout the difficult times. Currently, my spouse is expressing a challenging emotional situation. We are requesting to be allowed to be with them to provide a necessary emotional support for the success. It has been a year since we have only able to communicate through the audio calls and I long to physical touch. As a new lady, we wish to celebrate our love together in a person, not to a phone screen and mile apart. I forced to leave my country without my 16 months old child just due to late visa arrival from IRCC. How can it be possible? We were in the same application, but my child's visa received three months later than university deadline. And now my family and I having such a bad situation my baby is just facing psychological problem and there is no hope i need them just be with me but there is no hope because of the line processing time of the ircc after 10 years of marriage being far from each other for a few days was like a nightmare but it happens through this process the, the anxiety and fear through this process was enough hard for me uh, that I cannot bear another challenge, but it happens. Uh, about one month ago, I figured out that my husband needed an urgent surgery. That the main reason that I come back to my home country. So now I'm in the middle of hospital and waiting for my husband in the rehab room. And I just want to say that all I want is to expedite this process. All I want is to have my little family nearby me. We miss each other endlessly. We can't feel calm and safe. You can't imagine how painful this separation is for us, especially we don't know how long it may continue. According to this, all the time, my husband asked me, persist me to come back to visit each other. But according to my commitment to my study and work, I can't do that. This situation 
has put us under a lot of mental pressure. I can't focus on my study and he can't work as well. Within a month, it's going to be her birthday and I can't have her beside me. I remember the time that I promised to take her out for dinner and celebrate her birthday, but now all I can do is to send her a text message and see her face through my phone screen. My work condition don't allow me to travel to my country and because of the poor quality and the lengthy visa process, we can't focus on any part of our life. It has been more than two years we didn't see each other. We didn't have any collaboration together. Like our New Year's no rose, Mina's birthday, even my birthday. And we can't do anything. As the Persian New Year approaches, we kindly require assistance in expediting the exposed upper work with visa process for Iranian so that we may celebrate this ancient Iranian festival together with our loved one. Iranian New Year's is coming on March 21st, but it is really and especially hard for me because we can't celebrate and be together to celebrate Puria's birthday. Please speed up the application for open work permit visa. All we are asking from IRCC is not to interfere the process, but we are asking to speed it up, please, so we can be together soon. Thank you.